Hi everyone, Maggie here again to talk to you more about feminine leadership and obviously climbing the ladder in a skirt. And this is day three of the 30 day video challenge that I'm getting involved in. And today, because we've, we've just had the elections here in Scotland, which has actually seen three key, ma three key females contest um, as the leadership of their party, it had me thinking about role models and people that we considered as, you know, heroes or, or even people that we looked up to or helped us aspire to, to what we might do um, when we were younger. And one of my role models or, of, of people that, you know, is someone that I really admired when when I was younger was Margaret Thatcher. Now here in the UK that brings out like, oh my god, she ruined the country. And you know, and, and of course as a as a wee Aussie, I'm sitting there going, I'm sorry, it's not about her politics. But I you, you have to remember at the time that I was a young girl, Maggie Thatcher stepped into an amazing opportunity and position and and actually showed some real leadership as a as a woman and in the time because there just weren't that many female leaders full stop and there still haven't been that many more but she was almost like a forerunner um, for, for me and, and my generation. Now, now we've got a lot more coming up. You know, we've, there's a lot more out there here in Scotland. We've got Nicola Sturgeon, who's been re-elected yet again. We have um, Ruth Davies, who's the leader of the Conservative Party here and, and you know, uh, in her words, going to be holding the SNP to account. We have... Um, Kezia Dugdale, who, who's the leader of the Scottish Labour Party. We have a number of prominent um, you know, leaders in places around the world. And we also have the, you know, the, the increase in numbers of, of women that were elected into parliament in Iran, for example, and the upcoming elections in the US, which potentially could see the first women step into the White House, depending on the outcome. It could all see, also see that, you know, Donald Trump, who knows? But the point of the matter here is you know that those leadership roles and the key people that are out there in order to inspire young women today there's a lot more prominent and a lot more there and i think it's an amazing opportunity and it's definitely something that has been turning over in my mind leading up to the weekend and because of the recent elections here so i thought i'd share that with you so Thank you for staying with me a bit longer than usual and I'll be speaking to you again tomorrow a little bit more about more things that, that really get me inspired and, and led to Up the Ladder in the Skirt. And I wish you an amazing weekend and I look forward to chatting to you again over the next 28 days. Thank you and bye.